I actually first met Steve when I was a club coach in the Chicago area and he was coaching here at Wisconsin and I'd see him recruiting. He'd come out and watch the teams and uh, you could just tell he's a high energy guy, really nice to meet and just talk to anytime, very comfortable. Um, and actually I then after coaching in Chicago got a job down at Illinois State and I was an assistant down there for just three months and Steve gave me a call and said, hey, we've got an assistant position open and we'd love to have you come join us. And I was really uh, stuck because I really wanted to come back to Madison, but I'd also just taken a job down at Illinois State and I just bought a house down there. So I declined his offer um, and he went on to hire somebody else. But I left Illinois State after two years and was a head coach at Northern Illinois and met up against him a couple times. And his teams were always just scrappy, hardworking teams and uh, tough to play against. I just remember he had great energy on the sideline. Uh, he was very passionate about his team and he just pushed them to be the best they could be, but still enjoy the game. Steve made a big impact on the Wisconsin volleyball program. Uh, he brought a higher level of recruits to the game. He brought the fans out. It really was the explosion of Wisconsin volleyball, not just here in Wisconsin or Madison, but nationwide. It really put Wisconsin on the map. And our fans started coming out in record numbers, and they've increased ever since. And I still have people that come to matches now that are season ticket holders that started when Steve got them uh, excited about the sport and and they've just been loyal to us ever since so he made a huge impact and on a, on a regular basis I think about him and what he's done for the program and I try to do this some of the same things. It's really great that we have an opportunity to honor Steve uh, for Steve Lone Knight in the first Big Ten match of the season here at home. Um, you know the fans come out like I said some of them remember Steve as a coach. Uh, we get to talk to our players about Steve because obviously they were very young when he was around as a coach but just to let them know that he was the beginning of a great legacy here at Wisconsin. And now when the fans come out, you know, we've honored him this year. We have a wristband where everybody comes out, they get a free wristband that's got his name on it, Wisconsin Volleyball, and lets us take this time to really think about him and what he's done for our program. Each year we give out the Steve Lowe scholarship to one of our players, and it really goes to one of our players who epitomizes what Steve brought to the game, which is great passion and love for the sport. Somebody who's very dedicated to what they're doing here and wants to do great things for Wisconsin Volleyball. Make sure everybody comes out Friday night and gets a free wristband that's going to be at the door for as long as we've got them. And uh, uh, we're expecting big crowds, so come out and help us out. going to be a great Big Ten season.